Hey guys, it is Sunday, June 5th, 2017, and I'm back with some more room designs. And to share them with you, I've got Mandy in studio. Hey, Mandy. Hey, Michael. And Sally is here. Hey, Sally. Hello. So I'm really excited to show you guys this bunch because there's a whole series of new players who have sent me designs. So let's get right to it. Now, here's the first one. This is pretty cool. It's Woofer's Restaurant, and this was sent in by Woofy. Now, I like what they've done here. We have that rock and roll theme that actually has recently retired to the Curio Shop. So you can find it in the Curio Shop shop but they combined it with some of the diner items there along with some other stuff to make it feel like a rocker diner yeah it looks great the colors work perfectly and i love the black and white countertops with it because i think they're not from uh they're just the debbie shop the, yeah it works so well together with those instrument tables i don't remember what they're called but it's perfect mm -hmm. and sally this reminds me of something like the hard rock cafe i think it that's really pretty does. cool yeah i love that they have all the rockers pets in here oh as yeah well. very cool so really cool place to hang out. Great job, Woofy. Let's move on here. This is a 57 Chevy showroom, and this was sent in by Rhonda. Now, those are pretty cool. Mandy, do you remember where you can get those beds? I do not. I, I have not seen young, those. So. Oh! Yes! I don't know. <laughs> Why do I not know that? Because I do love that. Aren't you a so. deluxe member? Come on. I am a <laughs> deluxe member, but for some reason, I haven't gone for the cars. I went for all the furniture. Yeah, but it's pretty cool. Every month, deluxe members can choose any item that they want not from that the fun cars. to be young room theme. And there they've picked four of those beds. And look at that, Sally. There's posters on the walls mm -hmm. that really work well here. And so are those flowers really bring out the pink in all these items, tie everything together. And they were from our spring celebration theme. Now that wallpaper, what one was that again? I remember that the doors and windows are built into it. Yes, right? that was Which a quiz. Is really cool. That was a quiz, guys. It's from the neo gothic uh, rare theme from the <laughs> Curio Shop. Michael, you keep putting us on the spot. <laughs> I know. Are those I'm sorry. The, the new hotel dining chairs in there? Yes. Oh, cool. Someone had a good bake sale. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, those are from our bake sale events where you could combine baked goods on a stove for a prize. But great job. And framing it all, actually, there's that year 12 trophy, which really looks well in that room as well. But great job, Rhonda. Let's move on here. Now, this one was sent in by Resolution 265 and this is a mod patio. Now Mandy, you recently built a room with the mod patio items, yes? Yeah, and I used a floor tile too. I don't know, if, I don't think it was the same one, but it was a similar idea and yeah, that's so pretty with the mosaic colors and I like that they use the mod patio items, but then they also use those mosaic benches because those are great too. Those which, which are family people. score prizes. Yeah, yeah they're so they beautiful. must have been in the trading room yeah, maybe. Trade. Yeah, and those are those peaceful forest trees, which are so pretty. The ones with the sort of gray white leaves. Yep, and Sally, those little side tables there, the yellow ones, are those Webkin's News Prize, I believe? Not sure. So I think those might have been the fresh air tables that yeah. we gave away in a final the ah, ad around yeah, Easter. Right. Th that wasn't a quiz this time. I really don't know. <laughs> um, <laughs> okay, but great job. Resolution 265. Let's move on. Now, this one's really cool. It's a sunflower wedding venue, and this was sent in by Webkin's Queen Ruler, and it's really, they've created a really peaceful outdoor atmosphere here. Yeah, it's so pretty. It's so simple. Like, if you wanted a simple country wedding, this would be just ideal. Yes, and Sally, most of those flowers you see here are available in the W Shop, correct? Yeah, I think uh, pretty much everything here is. Yeah, except actually the bench yeah at the very end that's a rare item it's part of the victorian garden theme but um, really well put together really well designed great job webkin's queen ruler let's move on here now we've seen a lot of art studios uh, mandy haven't we but this one by dragon keeper 813 was really nice because i like how they've divided it into all these little sections yeah and i like that they've used a lot of the items from the theme you know they've got the kiln there and yep. the potter's wheel i love this there's a painting area, there's a potting area, there's, you know, sort of a craft and sewing area. Oh, yeah, that's fabric on the wall. I was yeah. That was craft paper. Yeah, really clever the way they've divided it. Mm hmm and the, uh, the classroom cubbies definitely go well. Yeah, they're yeah. so colorful and they, they really work well here. And that wall divider too, that Webkin's wall divider that's spray painted, um, that's pretty cool. I yeah, believe perfect that's... for the creative thing. Yeah, I think that was from the e-store, but uh, it works really well here because it looks like a, a work of art in progress or maybe just finished. So great job, Dragon Keeper 813. Let's move on here. This one is a shamrock bedroom and it was sent in by 
Caitlin. Now, uh, St. Patrick's Day has come and gone this year, but um, I see some of the prizes, or at least one big prize there, the window that was from a past Leprechaun in the Clubhouse event. But I think this room is really cool. Again, not a lot of items, but great placement of each one and a real nice collection of items to make up this room. Yeah, and I like the way they've used touches of gold, like uh, that sun clock and the hippo on yeah. a half shell painting. Mm -hmm. That really stands out against the green too, which is really pretty. Yeah, even those oranges on the tree really give yeah. bring that gold color out. It almost looks like the golden light from the stained glass window is reflecting off those oranges. Yeah. Yeah, now, one of my favorite windows that we have in Webkin's World are those medieval windows that they've used there. And they look like almost from a turret on a castle or something, which is actually fitting for this room. And there it's overlooking some sort of kingdom. But I love those narrow ones. And they're, of course, are available from the Curio Shop. Yeah, so there you go. Great job, Caitlin. Let's move on. This one is pretty cool. It's a Webkin's condo. And it was sent in by Sale 0123. But again, they've really divided this room well into different sections. And they've used large variety of prizes. Now, I love that laptop. Sally, was that a Webkin's News Prize? Or I think actually we gave it away for a deluxe day. I can't remember. Uh, if it's the trendy news blogger one, it's from Webkin's News. Right, cool. I just got that one today, actually. Oh, wow. <laughs> On Scans World. So Very yes, cool. I can confirm. Visit webkinsnews.com and take a look at the prize that you can win there by collecting currency on Gans World or Webkin's News. There you go. And I love the rainy springtime windows. Those are from our spring celebration event. And in the left corner, there they also have a I think it's a Kinsville shop window and that you could make during one of our bake sale events yeah I like the pinks and purples mixed with that lime green and chocolate brown like that's such a yeah. such a fresh combination well you know I wouldn't want the same color throughout my whole no, house so I love it's nice it to have some yeah. variety like this absolutely and they've done a great job putting that together so great job sale zero one two three this is the last one that we're gonna see today it's a simple design but it's I found it really effective it's a Webkin's movie theater and this was sent in by Peyton. Now there, of course, is the concession stands with the big lineups. Now I want popcorn. Yes. <laughs> but I love that on the left there, there's that sort of movie marquee kind that, of thing there. That's that, a family score prize, it isn't is, it? Yeah. yeah. And yeah. I don't know if the, that tiger there or lion is selling merch or, or promoting a movie, but they have two Dex Dangerous. <laughs> well, maybe um, he's uh, signing autographs. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Actually, it's supposed to he's be Dex. He's just had a haircut. Right. Yes. There you go. <laughs> he's had his head shaved for a roll. Yeah, there it's you a go. Wig, okay. <laughs> so yeah, he's there maybe at a movie premiere and he's going to sign um, some of his figurines, but that's really cool. It really feels like, you know, when you're at a lobby of a movie theater, it's perfect. All right, there you go. Well, thank you guys to everybody who sent me a room design. Keep them coming. You can email them to me at letsbuildatgans.com. Thank you, Mandy. Thank you. Thank you, Sally. Thank you. And thank all you guys, and we'll talk to you soon. Bye. Bye. Bye.